these guys. So this thing is a mission. And I used a method on YouTube to loosen this thing by putting the nut back on and using a, a wrench and then pushing it like that. But like everybody tells you, safety first. When this thing slips, it ends up like that. <laughs> a moose knop against a cop. Yeah, so it cleaned up well. Uh, no stitches needed, no plaster even needed. But yeah. Hello people, so Mike went for the first drive today with uh, Jesus looking bam beautiful We're still figuring out about the roof. Let's check. Yeah, it boiled over, <laughs> and then it wouldn't fucking want to start. Okay. It just went click, click. <laughs>
which they are. Now we've got a problem. Managed to get it out here, but it's it's taking a piss. I don't know why. Now it's stopped. It's a bit risky. We're going to let it cool down a bit and then see what happens. I don't know why. Get a bucket of water now. It's pissing the water out and getting too hot. I don't know if it's the water pump or what. Fuck it. water out mm -hmm. okay and the, this thing that where's this thing now this thing that we made yeah so you see so we made we made this thing to fit on there mm -hmm. okay because it was easier to get this pipe and there, come and form that. And, and that see. is too small, too thin. No, 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 no. Okay. So after like 15 minutes, it would push the water up out of the radiator. Now look inside here. Check. Okay, so that's what we've got there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now here's the original one. Which, the problem was that we couldn't get this thing on here because there's a big flange here. And the small one and at the top. And there's a small one there. But now, so now, yeah, we have to remodify the fitting for here. Okay, so this will work here and here. But then, shit, to get it around to come up there, it's it's virtually impossible. But you see the inside here. It's got a patent on it. So, the water comes in from the radiator, the pump pushes it out here, and then into the engine. But look what it's got inside. Okay. You see, so, so, the, so the water filler comes in here, but the pump pushes it out, and then through here. Okay. And instead with this one, it just pushes it, just pushes it, up. it straight out of the fucking radiator. Mm. You know, so 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 now the the issue is okay. So if you get this thing in here now, okay, it'll fit there. That's for the temperature gauge. Look here. <coughs> now you come around, and there mm. is virtually impossible. I went and bought all sorts of pipes. How can you go from a flange rubber here to there? Film here. From here to here. This is like fucking 60 mil and that's 35 mil. Okay. So so what we're going to do now is I'm going to take the radiator and have this thing Shouldn't here. the radiator be pushed forward a little bit? No, no, no. I'm going to make this flange, put it, put it there, but with a bigger pipe. Okay. Then we can, then we can actually get this thing on. Okay. And you see, then it'll fit. It'll basically fit. I've got to take it to Oaks. Okay, I'm going to push this now. But when it's in there, it'll work. But underneath it, instead of being in the front, it must be here. Yeah. They must make that flange in there. 
and then I think it's going to work and it won't push out the water. But you see. So we connected the uh, electric fan to help with the coolant. Four brakes. brakes. Huh? Parkour. Okay, so we're going to, yeah, we need to readjust the brakes. Yeah. And when you, I was going down slowly. Mm. I was going down slowly. And you know, just stand on them like, hey. And if you pull the handbrake, it's not it's it's there's nothing working. <laughs> <laughs> the handbrake was up now. <laughs> okay, but the temperature hasn't come the up. The temperature is still good. Cool. Cool. And it didn't ignite, <laughs> so that's cool. Yeah. All right. Well, we know what we've got to do this week. My main worry was the temperature. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
pre-ignition. <laughs>